Okay, so by now you've watched the slideshow and you've set up your letters. So you can see I have upside down written here in block letters. And notice how I erased those uh, guidelines that I had at the top and the bottom. Here and here, here and here. Okay, because you don't need those anymore. Okay, so our first step is we need to make a dot in the center. That's right about here. And that is our vanishing point. Okay, so I'll press, oh, I'm going to make it really dark so you can see it. Okay, so and now I'm going to take my ruler or straight edge or bookmark, whatever you've got. Okay, and I'm going to get all those orthogonal lines. In. So what I did, and I don't know if you watched the slideshow, but you can see this on the slideshow as well, is I take the ruler, okay, and I kind of anchor it, well, always, 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 always anchor it on that vanishing point right there, okay? And I'm going to anchor it there, and I'm going to start like a windshield wiper and find the first area, that curve right here where the U is, and that is where I'm going to make a dot. Okay, that's where my first orthogonal line is gonna go. And then I'm gonna keep windshield wipering until I hit the corner right here, this part. Okay, and then windshield wiper again, this corner. It's easy with corners. You don't really need to windshield wiper with corners. Okay, so here and here and here. And now this is where I'm going to use the windshield wiper. Okay. I'm going to go until I get to the edge of that P. And it's right about there. So I'll make a dot with my red pencil. Okay. I'm going to go back. I know I need to put one here. And now I need to do the windshield wiper again for the S. And it is right here. Okay. So when you can't see any more of the letter, then you know you need to make the dot. And then corners are easy. We need one here and here, okay? So you may ask, well, why not one there? Well, you don't need that because that line would go through your S and you don't want any orthogonal lines to go through your letters, okay? So that line is hidden behind your S. Okay, so we're gonna move on. To the eye, we're gonna need one there. We're gonna need one here, okay? They're probably gonna cross, this one's probably gonna cross that one, but we're gonna make a dot anyway. We'll need one here, here, and here. We won't need one there, right? Because it is going to go through the eye. We're gonna need one here, here, and then I'm going to do my windshield wiper to find the edge of the D. And that's where it hits it, right here. Okay? So I'll need one here at this corner, at this corner, this corner, this one, this one. I won't need one here once again because it goes through the letter. Okay? These are all going to go through the letter, so we don't need to make a red dot there. So then I'm going to turn my paper around so I have down looking straight on at me and I'm going to work right to left so this is easy I'll do the corner of the N the corner here 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 and here I won't need one for the W here because it goes through the letter I do need one here I need one here I will need one here, here, here. Will I need one there? Oh, just a teeny weeny bit. I'll put one there. I won't need one there, but I will need one here. Okay, and then I'll use my windshield wiper, find the edge of the O, and it's right here. Make a dot. Windshield wiper to this side, make a dot. And then windshield wiper from the vanishing point to the D. And it is right about there, so I'll make the dot. And I won't need one there. Sorry, I will need one there. Okay, 
Okay, but I don't need to use my ruler as the windshield wiper. And then I'll need one in this corner. Okay, I won't need one here once again because it goes through the letter. So I'm gonna grab my pencil and now I'm going to start drawing all of my orthogonal lines, okay? So all the orthogonal lines need to meet at the vanishing point. All right, so make sure your ruler or your straight edge is up on that vanishing point. And then you just start drawing out your orthogonal lines, okay? Now notice when I get to the top of the letter, I'm gonna draw that orthogonal line and I'm gonna stop when I hit the end. You never, ever, ever want your orthogonal lines to go through the letters. Okay, so I need one here. Here. And here. So. This is gonna cut across a little, that's okay. Okay, I won't have to draw that one out because it's already going through. I'll do one here. That one's really close, that's okay. Need one up here. This is gonna work, yeah. Okay, so it'll stop at the W, right? Okay. And once again, Stop when you hit the letter. Okay, so those are all our orthogonals for the down part. Okay, so now I'm gonna flip my paper over and do upside. I start on the right side because I'm a lefty, but if you're a righty, you'd start on the left side and then you would Use your right hand, all right? Okay. So. There's that one. Remember, this one will stop when it hits the letter. Okay. This one will stop when it hits the letter. And here you're going to notice that the E is going to hit the D, so we'll just stop right here when we hit the D. I'm gonna go back to my D. Draw that. And once again here, I will only draw it until I hit the letter, right? Okay, and then I'm gonna go back here to the eye. Stop at the letter again. That one's gonna be really close. That's okay. Now these are probably gonna go over each other. That's all right, it'll look kind of weird, but that's the correct way. Okay, it might be different on yours. It just depends on the placement of the letters. So this one is probably gonna have to touch, so I'll stop when I hit the, that S part, right? I'm gonna go back here and do this. Oh, I forgot one, I just realized it. I need one more right here, right? So windshield wiper to the edge of my S. There we go, okay. So the P will intersect 
the S, so I'll stop when I hit the S, right? Oh, I forgot another one. I forgot one. I forgot this one. Okay, that's that's no big deal. I'll just draw it until I hit the P. Stop when I hit the P. Oh, I forgot another one. I forgot this one up here. That's all right. It's easy to forget the ones on the top. Okay, so then we have the last one. And we're done. Woohoo, looks good. All right. So after you're done with this, you're gonna wanna turn this in and let me see it before you add any color or Sharpie to it. All right. Bye.